What's up folks? Dave, live from the shed. We're just back out here. The shed truck trying to get it working. Uh, Jay's up here practicing some new skills. What you doing, Jay? Uh, this is how you become a police officer. <laughs> you filming me? You filming me? I'll fucking get you! Hey, watch yourself, fucking. Practicing your moves? You'd make a great cop, buddy. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Gotta watch your body. Whoa. Here we go. Just trying to boost the truck. We got we got double boost action going on here. Yeah, they say to be nice to the shed, Jay. We gotta save it for the museum. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. You'll make a great cop one day when we clear your record. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't worry, we're gonna save the shed, folks. We'll take care of it. <laughs> And then uh, we'll we'll get a we'll get a like a wax figure of you. We'll get you right up in the seat. I'll buy them, man. Yeah. No, I wish I was a millionaire. I'd buy all these trucks right now, and we could start that museum. Buy all the trucks? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Apparently, people have started selling these flags online. Did you hear that girl say that? I mean, the color doesn't matter, but no, it doesn't. The cops didn't find that one, eh? <laughs> there we go. Well, we got her cleaned up a bit, got the snow out of the truck, but now. Uh, hungry. I got subs in my month back for us three weeks ago. They still, they still in there? Is the uh, the toilet still working? Oh yeah, here we got a collector's item here. You guys need to see. <laughs> Yeah, what do people pay for that? Auction that off? Freedom Fighters, yellow stuff. Yeah, that's straight from the Freedom Fighters. <laughs> so yeah, we're just here trying to get the truck running. Got her all uh, hooked up. But uh, yeah, let's get a tour. What do you think, Airbnb? Could we rent this out? <laughs> Watching, they can tell us, but no. the idea would be uh, a beam across here like this, and then uh, we're gonna punch a hole in the roof, and then uh, Ben's crane will lift that off so that we can be the proper height going home. Yeah, so we're, we got to remove the shed from uh, from the truck in order to get it home, but we will we will keep it in one piece. I think I make a great Airbnb. We've got two beds. Two beds, you got a private washroom over there. Uh, we can leave a bucket of water outside for a shower. Yep. People would pay good money for that. I actually, the I Toronto have, real estate prices, you could probably, 500 bucks a night or something. I <laughs> this might be Ty and Ashley's uh, honeymoon home actually on my property. Ah, oh, not a bad idea. <laughs> she was talking about maybe, uh, you know, sneaking a spot. Well, this would be a perfect little room for two newlyweds, right? I think it's a great way to start a marriage. Definitely. Yeah. Tyler's, uh, you can tell him, Tyler's back at your place now, right? Yes, Tyler uh, is parked in front of the barn. I've never had such a nice vehicle on my property before. I'm pretty pumped about that. There you go. <laughs> I gotta sneak by you though. I yep, get back, to work. back to work. That's what we do around here. The, uh, the shed is going, uh, staying in Ontario. Yeah, so as some of you guys would know if you've been following most of the trucks that were uh, down on Wellington were from Ontario. So mostly heading back there. Oh. And uh, Ben's over here too with the 
stage truck. So this is the one that was uh, right in front of the shed where the stage was and everything. I don't know. I don't know where Ben is right now. Not here apparently. Well, yeah. Got some other boys cleaning out their trucks. Yeah, a lot of the keys were left on and stuff, so the batteries all died. Well, yeah, we gotta. I'm gonna use the crane to uh, lift off the shed. I'll be sure to. Uh, film that when it happens so keep an eye out for yeah we'll get a live when we take the uh, the shed off and then we gotta Jay's truck is probably not gonna drive out of here so it's probably gonna get towed working on it giving the police a show they're just hanging out watching yo oh what's oh this is our uh yeah, here we go. The, when we started meeting everybody, we, the we got. And the and the Where's my CC? Is it here? Uh, oh. Well, that's why I threw that down there for you. Kevin69, in right there. <laughs> Wendell, so F. Trudeau. Uh, there you go. <laughs> anyway, fun, fun yeah, this guy single handedly organized the whole block and. Uh, Got everyone working together. Started out meeting in the shed, but that uh, that didn't last too long. Remember the nights we'd have like 10 guys crammed in there? <laughs> or the driver's meetings with about 25 guys in there. Yeah, yeah, that first meeting you had where you just, guys, was it Mike you guys lost it on each other or just? <laughs> yeah. Um, a lot of alpha males in one room, in one shed. It was a little tense, some tense moments. But we. we oh, there you go. Still from my freezer at home. Grass fed beef. I don't know if that's any good anymore. It looks like it melted once. Ah, it's probably still good. We can try it out. Some little muffins there. Still good. Still good. This is Jesse. I don't know if you met Jesse. Say hi. That's King Jesse. King Jesse. I don't really like publicity. <laughs> I mean, James. James. Yeah. How's James Alfred. doing? <laughs> um, he was not involved whatsoever and has. I've never met him before. <laughs> nice to meet you, James. Yes, How you doing? Just showed up on the scene. Just showed up on the scene with some tools that you happen to have unrelated to anything at all. You can see you, you can talk to James's lawyer if you if you want. <laughs> He's James, remember? We just met him today. He had nothing to do with any of this. <laughs> Jesse James, yeah. That's the one. I was gonna have coffee every morning too once. What happened I with that? Have, I did have coffee every morning, but I never needed to use my shoe. Cause I stole all your generator power from my live streaming. <laughs> yeah, I uh, I kicked everyone else off the power because it was all we could do to keep the cameras running <laughs> with that crappy generator that you bought. Yeah, you're pretty, uh, you can't take over, you can't push it, you? Yeah, that's how we roll. Oh, yeah. They're getting it cleaned up slowly. It's looking a little better than it was the other day. What? Oh, look at that. Live from the shed, brought to you by Fiber One. There's 28% of your fiber right there. <laughs> See, we had everything we needed. Everything we needed in the shed. <laughs> so, yeah, my, uh, my hands are getting real cold here. I really... Uh, should invest in one of those little streaming tripod things like a real youtuber so um to be clear this is live from the shed so last night i was a little rattled because i uh went online and some ran some random person had shared my videos and had like a paypal link looking for donations and uh that threw me off a little bit so 
Um, I figured out how the. I hope they were being good and they were actually donated to the truckers. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and say no. No, sadly there were a lot of, you know, there were some, uh, you know, I'm all about people making money. That's good, but when they were doing it under false pretenses, that was a little annoying, to be sure. The, um, but yeah, live from the shed. If the channel says something else, it ain't the shed. So, um, we're getting together with the shed crew uh, this week sometime, and uh, you can meet the whole gang. We were kind of separated because me and Jay and Ash and Tyler are up here, and then Sam and Teak and Brad and some of our other crew were back home. So we're gonna reunite. And uh, there's talks of taking the shed on the road, so stay tuned for that. The shed is not done. It's only just beginning, isn't that right? Yes, sir. <laughs> So if uh, if you're in Canada, keep an eye out. We uh, may be doing live from the shed on the road. I don't know if some, yeah, there you go, Freedom Shed Tour 2022. They already have a name for it. So <laughs> so yeah, we uh, we're around the you know you know how things went down there on uh, last weekend in Ottawa. And uh, I don't know if we're getting any vehicles into Ottawa anytime soon, but it's a big country. So, um, yeah, we'd love to um, potentially take this old girl uh, on the road and come meet some more of you guys. So keep an eye out for that. And, uh, yeah, maybe uh, we'll see how many of the boys we can get in for that. Maybe you can meet some of them along the way. And um, But, yeah, still in the... Uh, yeah, Reverend Kevin, If uh, you never know where he ends up, so if he's still in this country or something, then maybe he'll come for the ride, but um, we'll keep you informed as it happens. Oh, Ben made it back. You want to say hi? Hi. This is Ben. He drove the, uh, he drives the crane truck. That was the stage, so you had a nice uh, relationship with the police too, right? You had a good time? <laughs> yeah, you might have seen it, guys, on uh, on the internet there. This guy took pepper spray point bank to the face, but took it like a boss. So, as, Didn't feel like it. No. No, yeah, they, uh, they roughed him up pretty good and sprayed him right in the face with a pepper spray from like six inches away. So that um, would not have felt nice great guy Ben's a really nice guy um, yeah his uh, stage was a big part of this and um, maybe we'll be able to get that on the road too um, but yeah lots of fun stuff to come there's talk of uh, trucker fest maybe get a little music festival together we can set up some trucks get a band back up on here and have some fun so yeah the movement is alive the, uh, so long as we have Canada, we will have freedom fighters. So, um, yeah, great, uh, great to uh, be bringing you updates. And yeah, we'll, uh, I'm figuring out this YouTube thing slowly but surely. But um, anyway, I'm gonna turn this off for now. But uh, yeah, maybe it might be a couple hours yet. But I'll I'll, t I'll pop on here later and um, show you guys when we remove the shed and whatnot. Um, almost got monetized. We're still working on that. We're just, it's a bit of a, a pain. Google doesn't seem to want to rush to approve us, but uh, somewhere along the way we'll get monetized. Um, for now, I always feel super weird asking this stuff, but I know people seem to like to contribute, so you're welcome to uh, uh, send an e-transfer to um, live from the shed 2022 at gmail.com. The, uh, the link is on the channel profile there. So, um, yeah, no pressure whatsoever. Enjoy the content and happy to be able to share our stories with you. Um, but by all means, chip in and uh, might uh, be able to help go towards the uh, Live from the Shed tour if we get that pulled together one day. So, 
Anyway, I'll uh, I'll tune in there later when we're further along with this, and we'll let you see the the shed getting rolled out. So, take care, folks.